This, of course, the setting for so many moments in British history. Do you think this will be seen as a, as a great moment of British history? I think it's uh, emblematic of a particular point in British society. Um, you have to ask the question, why is it 23 years after she left government that Mrs Thatcher is still such a controversial figure? And I think part of the answer is that we still haven't come to terms uh, with the hurt and anger that many parts of society have felt because of the legacy of her government policies. And the memory of those is being revived by the current policies that the government has got in terms of trying to address the deficit. Uh, and there's some real work to be done here about what's the relationship between the rich and the poor in our society and how can we try and work together um, instead of being opposed to one another. Um, and that's a particular agenda which I think this funeral will be throwing up and highlighting. On that basis, such a divisive figure we, as we've seen, are you comfortable hosting the event here? You have to remember every funeral is ambiguous. Um, because none of us uh, live up to our own ideals um, and all of us hurt people in ways sometimes we're not aware of. And one of the key things about this funeral is that it's based on the Book of Common Prayer service, that was Mrs Thatcher's own wish, which is quite an austere service and running right through it is that theme of praying for God's forgiveness and love to cover our own lack of love to God and our neighbour.